The um, word nightmare is now used rather feebly and loosely for any bad dream or any anxiety dream. But the nightmare was originally thought to be a person, or sometimes a giant cat, who sat on one's chest and oppressed one's breathing. Um, and, uh, and feelings of, of utter helplessness and dread would go with this. One could not move, one couldn't do anything about it. Uh, there was a sense often of imminent death. Uh, a nightmare is not a dream, and indeed one is not asleep when one has a nightmare. One is awake, but one cannot move. Uh, inability to move and hallucination are characteristic of dreaming sleep. Um, in the nightmare, one has partly woken up. Um, one is, uh, knows, one can see one's own bedroom in this and that, but one is unable to move um, and this hallucination is, is added. Nightmares uh, occurred to many people in cultures all over the world and um, seem to have given rise always to uh, different mythologies or different folk tales in Newfoundland, for example, the term night hag is used. The night hag is an old woman who, who is sitting on one's chest and squeezing the breath out of one. The, um, the baby, very great terror, but the heart will be going like that. Um, but, but the nightmare is an example of a stereotyped hallucination uh, which has given rise to analogous myths or folk tales all over the world.